Here comes the supervisor. <laughs> Today I'm going to take a little closer look at the supervisor frame. Now this is my boss medium frame that was featured in my 2018 starting lineup and this has been flying real well for me at the races. Now it is running these Racer Star 2206, 2306 motors and they're okay. They do fine on the over under, they do fine on the short straightaways, but on the long straightaways I find myself hitting full throttle a lot and the motors just aren't going fast enough. But that's what you get for using cheaper motors. <laughs> so today we're going to be looking at the supervisor frame, which is also using the Racer Star motors. Now these are 1407 motors and they run at 3500 kV. And I had these on another quad, and I never really got the quad well tuned, so it kind of never really flew real well for me. But I'm going to give it another shot because I had another set, and I didn't want to spend any more money than I had to on, on motors anyway, because I bought the HGLRC stack, and this one actually comes with the 40 amp 4 in 1 ESC, the flight board, the VTX, and the camera all in one. So basically, you buy the stack, and you got to add a frame and motors, and you're pretty much ready to go. So anyway, on here besides the HDLRC stack, I have these motors and the uh, propellers that are on here are Gem Fan 32, or sorry, 3052. 3052 props. Now this can actually spin three and a half inch props. You can see there's a lot of space there between the prop and the spacer, but I don't have any three and a half inch props, at least not three blade ones. So I'm going to be trying it initially with the uh, three inch props. So, I'm going to take this out to the flying field, we'll do a little flying with it, see how it flies, and my friend Bulldogger will probably tell me that it needs some tuning, and <laughs> hopefully he'll just do it for me, and then I'll just share all the tuning with you. So, also, in addition to this, my uh, bigger quad, my medium, has been using these Panda 1300 batteries, and they have a rating of 95 to 190 C. Whether or not that's true, is, I don't know, but these packs are still pretty solid, and they've been through a lot of crashes, and they're holding up well. So for this one, I'm going to be using some Panda 850s. These are 75 to 150 C rating, and uh, they should be fine as well. These motors have on the st on the stats form say they draw about 10 amps. So a 40 amp 4-in-1 ESC is way overkill, but you know you get what you get. So I'm going to try this out. Hopefully, we'll get some good flight footage, some DVR footage, and uh, we'll see what happens. I'm out here at drone practice, I'm about to test the supervisor. I printed a little 3D uh, shark fin to go on top so when it flips upside down, I can try out the um, turtle mode. I think I enabled it. I don't know. We'll find out in a minute. I'm flying with the 850 battery and we'll see how this goes. Take off. Almost made it to the table. This Almost. thing loose. My initial thoughts are this thing flies like it's on crack. It is so small that uh, it just seems like it's really maneuverable. The one thing is I need to raise the minimum throttle because when I'm flying along fast and I put the throttle all the way down, it gets to the minimum and it kind of goes, Whoop! it starts to fall. You have to gun it to, keep, to kick it back in gear and keep going. So, all right, we'll do some more flying. That crash ended with a broken battery strap. Uh, bulldogger here. 
he told me I should have rounded off the edges of the frame and I still need to do that. <laughs> so another thing I did on this quad is I went ahead and added the second battery strap on here just so that it wouldn't tear the battery quite as or tear the strap quite as easily next time and it's proven to be pretty nice so Two far. Two straps is life! <laughs> so I've been flying the supervisor out here today. There's some good things about it. First of all, if you crash and bend these props, they have a hard time reaching the wires to cut them up, so that's a big positive. The other thing is, it feels like I'm really just super, super fast, and then I get passed a lot by the five inch quads. So it's kind of disappointing that it's that way. Overall, I think this, I like this pretty well. I did manage to break a prop because someone ran into me, and, uh, but overall, it's pretty nice. I like this. It's prob it'd probably be a lot better if I was actually racing against other three inch quads because against five inch quads, these three inch blades just don't have a lot of torque. Some people can probably fly it faster than I can, but I'm not competing with the five inch quads out here, unfortunately. Anyway, this is the supervisor frame. I'll have a parts list down in the description if you're interested, you can look at, look at it. Like I said, it's mostly just the HGLRC stack with a set of motors and any frame you want and uh, it's ready to go, especially since it's 40 amp, it really doesn't matter what motors you get. Anyway, have any questions about it, leave them down in the comments. I will try to help out as best I can. And as always, thanks for watching. Five. Eight. Seven. 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 <laughs> that was some fabulous flying. Thank you. What do you have to say about that? Ready, set, go. All right, now it's time to compete. Go fight, win. This is legit. You guys ready? Flight mode one. Flight mode one, Travis. Make sure I can fly. Less than 10, less than three, go. Well, I was definitely going a lot faster with this one. I'm so torn, like I want to go straight and go diagonal through it, but it's, I need to go out and square up with it. Yeah. You just don't tell anybody course normally. Is an option. It's the Travis option. The course, Joey. I mean, I mean, go through ever. it. Best course ever. We'll just, I'll just go between the legs of the gate and don't hit the top, and you'll be fine, man. Soft. Go ahead, guys. And I'm upside down. You guys won. Well, I broke a lens and a frame. The the board's still good. Yeah, Joey's I'm in. Down, I'm down three quads today. 